Good morning, guys. Okay, since I may attempt this Vlogmas thing, I thought I would try to do another random vlog for the day and see if I can keep up with it. I do think I need to get, I'm in my bathroom right now, I need to get like a camera mount for my mirror. So if you have any recommendations on that, and I think I probably need to get one for my car because that's when I feel like I can do the most talking, but I can't hold it. So if you know anything about that or recommendations, let me know. We are going to our standing Wednesday morning play date. We go to Chick-fil-A as soon as the big kids go to school. So around 8 a.m. we get there, play, then we go to our library story time, and then it in, ends up being pretty much nap time. We come home, Vera naps, then we go pick up Q from school, and then just survive for the rest of the day. Me and Vera did last night, we, or yesterday afternoon, we ran into another Walmart to look for those turtlenecks that I posted about in my last vlog. They didn't have my size in any of the colors, but they did have it in the olive. So I'm trying to decide if I want to go back for that. And then also, I'm going to have to hold it with my other hand. Oh, sorry if this is, um, okay, I'll set you down here. Um, Da, da, da. Oh, yeah, a lady I follow on Instagram. She has a YouTube channel, Julianne, I think. She's Michelle1218's sister in law. She posted on her Instagram, she was doing a Walmart try on haul, and she got this little camo hoodie, and it was adorable. I saw it in there, and I saw the new winter holiday wax, but we were kind of in a hurry, so I was like, we'll have to go back tomorrow. So we may run back up to that other Walmart sometime today, but it's so cold here. If you are not familiar, I live in pretty much central Mississippi. So, you know, it's hot as literal hell in the summer. And our winters are usually pretty mild until January. But it's in the 30s already. It's crazy. And some parts of the state have snow right now. So, it's really cold. I mean, I don't even know. We never have this kind of cold weather. Um... This morning, I decided to just wear my It CC Cream because I'm honestly trying to finish it up. I probably have like two more uses. I didn't put any mascara on and I used my Milk Kush Brow Gel set with a little bit of powder and my NARS Laguna. And then for lips, I will probably use my Dior Lip Addict. Um, you know what I'm talking about? See, this, this is my natural lip color. I know I've mentioned before that I have a lot of pigment. Usually when you see me, I have on something that tones them down. Do you see how bright freaking pink my lips are? Like, that's why I don't want to wear pink lipstick because then I'd be crazy. Here, hold on. That shows you. Um, little update. Amy, I meant to message you this morning, actually. So... The Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow that I picked up in the Sephora sale, I, I just, I didn't feel like it was helping my skin. My skin was really, really going through some stuff. So I went to Sephora the other day and I bought the Drunk Elephant kit that came with this and the other minis. In two days, my skin looks almost back to how it was earlier in the year when I was wearing it, using this. This stuff just does so much for me. I mean, granted, I'm wearing the It CC Cream, and I probably should have popped on without it so you could see, but my skin looks amazing. I honestly didn't even want to wear makeup today, but I'm just trying to use up the It, so I was like, let me go ahead and use that. But, um, so I think I'm going to return the Honeymoon Glow. I really wanted it to work because it was like half the price. And Pharmacy is a good brand, but this... And then I pulled out my C Firma to use for the first time today. I'm back on the hot dog juice. Oh, I just, they, my skin loves the Drunk Elephant products. Y'all have a space heater going. I'm going to turn that off. So anyways, let me get off of here. Um, I'm going to have to wake up Vera. She never sleeps late. Of course, the morning we're going to go somewhere. She decides to sleep late. So, um, I never really talked to y'all in my bathroom. This is my earring holder. I got it from Avon, like like 20 years ago probably, but it's amazing. They sell them at TJ Maxx and stuff. The back side has more little slots, but I don't have that many. I mean, I, I have plenty. What I'm saying is I don't need to fill up the back as well. I just hang it on my door. So anyways, that's all for now. And if I'll just be back in touch with y'all. Okay. Yeah. 
So I haven't been back on here ever since I spoke to you last, obviously. We went to Chick-fil-A in the library and we didn't do anything else. You don't want the TV? Okay, do you want me to unplug it? Okay. We have a grumpy deal in the back seat. We didn't go anywhere because it was it's just so cold. I just wanted to go home and get warm. And during Vera's nap time, I really didn't feel that good, so I just laid down myself and then had to get up to come set in car line. But I checked the mail. This is hilarious, y'all. I have to share it with you. Okay, so Influencer, I haven't gotten anything from them in a while. And I'm not sweating. Okay, well, let me do this. And I realize free is free. I appreciate it. Mommy. But I'm kind of jealous. I haven't Mommy. gotten. Yes, Vera. I'm okay. Okay. Um, I've been jealous. I haven't gotten like that Lancome foundation or the Charlotte Tilbury lip products or even the Kat Bundy brow um, product. Well, I got an email like last night or the night before saying, congratulations, you're getting the Burberry fragrance box. And I was like, oh, well, that's awesome. So I get this in my mailbox and um, I was like, well, I guess they packed it in there. Y'all, you're going to die. That's what they sent me. They could have stuck it in an envelope. A padded envelope. I got this box box. <laughs> um, I, I mean, I'm appreciative. I'm not making fun. I'm not suggesting that I should have gotten a, you know, free bottle. Mommy, I want that. <laughs> a vibrant fruity Mommy. gourmand. Mommy. Yes, Vera. I want that. This? Yeah. Okay. So I will smell it when I get home. I don't want to spray it in the car in case I don't like it, but I will smell it when I get home and I will tell you about it, but I cannot believe that. I mean, that's hilarious. <laughs> like it's hilarious to me. I used to get, I got a, like um, a YSL mascara once and then somehow I got on these like family boxes and I was getting like dog treats and butter coupons and I mean, it was great, you know, I was appreciative of that, so, but then I was like, oh, I'm back on the beauty boxes. I don't know. This is just hilarious to me, so I had to share it with you. Okay, guys, if you saw in my last vlog when I had gone to Walmart, I picked up that flocked garland, and it turned out really cute. Um... My fireplace is, I think, a lot longer than I thought it was. It's nine foot garland, and I'd seen some pictures, and it had a lot hanging off the edge, but I mean, that's okay. It's It turned out really, really pretty. And then here is our tree. Let me see if I can scoot back a little. So, I really love the flock Christmas trees. I think they're adorable and I know I showed you some of those ornaments when we were um, in Target but I did end up bringing home the little kitty cat which is so adorable and then also well I think my daughter put um, her lol one on her tree in her room but we have ornaments I let the kids pick out one based on what they're into each year and so this was a Jake and the Neverland Pirates this I got for Vera actually this year then I also ended up getting this little deer originally for Vera and then I got the kitty cat one but we have all kinds like this is our Merry Christmas in our new home this was the first Christmas we celebrated in this house and the girls just picked these these little Crayola ones were actually ones my mother-in-law collected for my husband every year when he was a little boy and so we have a bunch of those that's one Q made at school you can see we have a hodgepodge and this oh, i love this little stained glass one we bought my <laughs> q has ended up taking most of our ornaments and putting them on her tree oh and then this is vera's from i think last year it's a little peppa pig there's another crayola one so that's just a little hodgepodge oh this one i got a few years ago it's really cute it's just a little glass teapot i try to get a few little ornaments each year that are just cute and you know 
that I love the little fox. We call that Lola because our um, Pomeranian looks kind of like that. There's a mini. Oh, I did get this one this year. I do. I need to cut that homework tag off. What else? Oh, this one. I don't remember when we got it, but it's like a little Pinocchio thing. It's really cute. So, and then these, a lot of these little felt ones I got when the kids were small so they could just decorate the tree and I didn't have to worry about it. And I do want to get a new um, tree skirt. We've had this one for so long. My husband really likes it. It's not my favorite. So I need to sneak a new one in. <laughs> but I thought I would just give you a um, little view of our tree. Holiday wax. This is a semi-dupe for Marshmallow Fireside. And that is a good dupe for hot cocoa. And cream or hot cocoa. I think I'm going to get that. Okay, these little hoodies at Walmart are so cute. And they're only $10. I think I'm going to try them all. Say hey. No, you're on here. Say hey. That's us. Say hey. Say hey. No, I know. You don't want to say hey? No. It's better parties. This is really cute. I tried it on. This is the large, though. I'm almost tempted to try on the extra large just for the length. It is so soft. Got this to try on. I think I'm getting this one for sure. This doesn't have pockets. I don't know if the other one did. But this is an extra large. They're definitely not um, generous sized. So, really cute. Time marches on. Time marches on. Days the same as everything changes. Everything changes. Okay, can't believe I'm letting y'all hear me sing. So, my mom has a rental car and I took it out. She came up because, you know, we're going out of town this light is on and nothing's open there's no way to turn it off i don't know this is a dodge journey it's a really um nice little vehicle it's always fun driving a new car um i'm about to go in michael's because i'm looking for this cinnamon broom that my friend lauren picked up um it's like a wicker looking broom that smells like cinnamon i don't know but i feel like i need to have it so my latte that I ordered at Starbucks, I got the Snickerdoodle Latte Iced. Um, I saw Meg's Makeup 8 did a post on her Instagram talking about it. And it's the Iced White Chocolate Mocha with the Cinnamon Dolce Syrup, which sounded really good. It's good. And no, I don't get Starbucks every day. It's like a weekly treat. It's just, I feel like... Um, I don't know. You've just seen them a lot lately. So, I know I never take off my sunglasses when I'm outside. I picked up the Natasha Denona Camel Palette, and I'm wearing it on my eyes today. I don't know how well you can see it. I really like it a lot. I don't know if you're going to see this video before the second Sephora sale starts, but they always have that little gift card promo. So, I have to say, if you like shadows similar to me, or you like just like, let me turn that down again, a little bit of color kind of neutral kind of you know toned down it's a really pretty palette I've had it on hours I mean I've had it on since like I don't know, pushing 8 a.m. so and it's five o'clock so it's definitely you know probably not its best but it's a really nice palette so I think I I don't know I'm gonna cut off this vlog if there's more then I'll edit this out so you can know because I don't want it to get too long um, and so I, I, it's been fun. Um, thank you for hanging out with me the past few days.